Hello everybody, this is another video about Obsidian. Yesterday I had something called a Doom Panic because I wanted to make some Doom levels and I deleted my current perfectly working version of Obsidian to install the latest version and I found out I couldn't do it because it required a new version of CMake that I didn't have. Now I could have just tried to install the new version of CMake on the Linux Mint I already had but Instead, I flew into panic mode, backed up everything, and installed the latest version of Linux Mint version 20.2. So this video is going to be tailored to installing the latest version of CMake and the latest version of Obsidian in the new version of Linux Mint. I went ahead and did everything and screwed it up ahead of time so that I can reinstall Linux and do everything again and screw it up less so that I can reinstall Linux and do it again this time while I'm filming a video. I've written everything down this time so I could do it again problem free. Can't promise it's going to be problem free. We'll see how that goes. Sometimes I just learn as I'm doing and that's how that's how it happens. So the very first step here I'm supposed to make a source code folder. I already have one of those. I should be deleting those from the folder, but I'll just do it later. Okay, you just want to clone the code from the git repository and switch to the folder. Just snoring here. Next you want to install the dependencies. Okay, this very next part you're going to want to do, dot slash bootstrap, I believe this is going to take approximately 15 minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and start this and stop this video. I think that took a little less than 15 minutes, maybe approximately 12. So now i got to run make. This is definitely going to take 15 to 20 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and start this and I'll see you as soon as this is finished. Okay, that was definitely longer than 20 minutes. It took so long I started falling asleep in my chair. Then I went to go lie down. And it took forever to wake back up. But I'm back. Anyway. I finished the make on this, so the very next thing is you got to type in sudo make install. That's it, great. Now you have the latest CMake installed, so you're not going to get that error when you go to compile Obsidian. Next, I want you to go up to your home folder and make an apps folder if you don't already have one. Okay, go into the apps folder. And then type in this git clone command for obsidian. Okay, I'm going to cd into the folder. And I'm going to make a new folder called build. Ah, uh, now I need to install dependencies.
Let's see, that's the next thing I'm not going to feel like typing in. Hurry up, I'm starting to feel my beard growing again. folder yet okay you want to type in cmake space dot dot okay let's see okay the very next thing is type in this CD command to go up to this folder and type in the command make I found out if I don't do this it's gonna freeze when I go to make the main program type in CD dot dot twice now type in the command make. That only took about an extra two minutes. Now type in cd dot dot one more time. Well it looks like the executable is already in this folder so I guess you can just launch it then. Oh, and it works. Great. I'm behind on making some megawatts, so I'm going to set this up and get this to go. I guess that's all there is to it. Thank you for watching this video, and don't miss my next video about Doom RPG with Roguelike Arsenal. See you then.